Let's take a look at the tool icon located in the tool palette. I'm going to click on these double arrows to open up my right hand shelf. And then I'm going to go up to my tool pull down. And then grab this little swatch and dock this over onto the right hand side. You notice that I have an icon here called tool. If I click on that it's going to open up a much bigger shelf. And inside this shelf we have a few areas. The first area are custom meshes that you've been working on. Also any 2.5D brushes. The second area is designated for the 3D primitives native to ZBrush. The third area is going to be for brushes much like highlighter brushes or filters that you might find in other programs like Photoshop. Things like highlight, erase, smudge, all sorts of different brushes that we'll talk about later. The fourth area down here will allow you to load a tool, save a tool, import a tool, or even export a tool.